What's going on guys, ABJ Carpe back with another video for y'all today, man. Today, I got some more power for y'all, man. I got a 2020 Camaro 2SS. Yeah, y'all heard me, I said 2SS. So, let's get right into it. Here we go right here, guys. Got the 2020 Camaro 2SS. Let me show y'all, so y'all know it's real, you know what I'm talking about? And the SS right there. Y'all see the gears on the top right there, man. It's gonna go around here. That nice orange, man. See right here, you got the orange brake calibers. Let me show y'all what we're working with. We got 245, 40s, and ZR20s. I'm nice. Now, I know the same ones that's on my Camaro, as y'all know, but, you know, they nice on here. Keep going around here. Y'all see up there, this one do got a sunroof. Which I said, I wish I had mine, but I'm gonna show y'all in a minute why I kinda like that I don't have it. But coming to the back, you see, this one has the spoiler up here, the high spoiler. This one got the doors, don't have the quads. I definitely want the quads on here. But keep going around. As y'all see, man, they orange nice, man. I'm gonna show y'all this sticker while I'm going around here. Y'all can pause on that if you want. Down. 475. Zoom them out. Keep on going around. And them orange calibers, man. I like that, man. The orange calibers match that orange, too. That's real nice. Y'all see that front facial? That thing is mean and aggressive, man. But let's head into the inside. So, going into the inside, you got right here. Got the button right here to lock the car. The button to unlock the car. Open it up. Gotta have the key file with you, though. So, coming on to the door you guys see right here you got your nice leather right here ain't too much padded just leather thrown right there maybe a little bit come on you got this is basically all like hard plastic you got your your doorknob lock on lock you got your your memory seat in here you got your regular window controls you got your um armrest which is basically leather not too much padding come around right here one thing that i like you got your ambient lighting right here it changes colors a lot of different colors, which I'm gonna show y'all when we get on in the car. You got your trunk button right here. You got your nice Bose sound system in here. Yeah. Come on right here. You got your Camaro. This also light lights up at nighttime too. So getting in here, 66300 man, and a Camaro. Close the door. Y'all see how I'm fitting in here? About the same how I fit in my car. Coming up here, let y'all see the instrument cluster. You see, you got 200 on the dash. Yeah. Yeah, we're going fast in here, man. But coming out, though, y'all see you got your Camaro symbol right here. You got your voice controls. You got your phone um, phone controls. You got your buttons right here, control the screen, as you see. Come over here, you got your heated steering wheel. Coming right here, you see you got your collision alert. Right here, you got your cruise control. Come down here, man. You can control your radio. You got your volume over here, which, you know, this when I, when I first got my mirror, man, I'll tell you one thing that this, I had to get used to this a little bit because, you know, you'll be used to pressing it forward or down, you know what I'm saying, but it's back towards you. But it's still nice. You see, you got your SS right here, flat bottom steering wheel, man, which is very nice coming over here. You have your, you see you got your lighter and everything like that. This one does, let me see if y'all can see that. This has got your heads up display right there, which is very nice, very, very nice. Coming over here to the infotainment system. Get out of there, man. You see you got your nice, man, 8 inch. It's nice. Like I said, y'all know these Chevy systems are, they are very basic and, you know, minimalistic, or at least in my opinion, like I said, more like an iPhone, man. Show you where everything is. You got your phone navigation, hotspot, Apple CarPlay. Got your apps and all things like that. Your ambient lighting, which I was talking about was on the door. So if you can see right there, it's kind of blue. So I come back over here and I press green. It'll slowly turn to green. You can see that it's kind of hard to see in the daytime, but that's very nice, man. Coming down here, you got your home button. Your regular, you know, move through your tracks if you want to. Coming down here. This one does have heated and cool seats. You got your regular um, AC controls, man. Now, one nice feature 
that when I first, also another thing when I first got my marrow that I love and it's very different is um, as far as turning the temperature up and down, as you see right here, this is the knob to turn the temperature up and down, which I think is very cool, man, because I don't know too many other cars that are doing this. And if you did not know or did not really pay attention, you would, I think somebody would certainly look over this. But coming over here, man, you got the nice Camaro on the shifter right here, man, 10 speed automatic. Coming over here, you got your modes. Show you the modes you got in here. So you got your touring, you got your sport, you got your track, and you got your snow and ice. Of course, they will stay in sport mode. Coming down here, you got your parking brake. You got right here, plug and plug your phone up. You know what I'm saying? Coming down here, you got your two cup holders. There I see you got the ambient light that's over there. Also, if you can see, it's right here. Continues right here. Open up a little storage armrest. I will tell y'all, there is very little. <laughs> This little storage space right here, it is, it is, it is small. I'm not gonna lie to y'all, this is very small. But you still got two USB ports down there, if y'all can see, and a uh, aux down there. Closing this up. Coming over here to these seats, y'all see this is full leather seating, man. You got the SS badge in the seats. I ain't playing no game. You know what I'm talking about? It's very nice, man. It's very nice. Nice, nice for the leather seats. Y'all see, you got the, the uh, this is kind of light gray, which goes with, we trim on the door. So we're gonna come to the door. Same as the driver's side, you know, you got your lock, man, lock, your handle, your window controls, and that ambient light, man. I love that ambient light right there. Got your nice bold sound system, man. And yeah, it's just a nice car, man. Got your little, a little cubby right here. Now that's one thing about this car, it do not have a lot of storage, which y'all know it is Camaro. But one thing I skipped over though, is the glove, glove compartment. That's it. It's nice in here overall, man. Let me show y'all. It's nice in here, y'all. Coming up here, y'all see you got your review mirror, but it's not just a review mirror. Flip this tab right here, and that shows you out back you got a camera showing behind you. As you know, a lot of people say, you know what I'm saying, these Camaros do have a decent size blind spots in the back, so this help you out a little bit, man. Coming up here, you got your lighting. You got your SOS, the on, on star and all that. And this one does have a sunroof, sunroof, which is very nice. You know what I'm saying? But like I said, this also chops off some head space for you taller guys. Like I said, like me, they uh, like Camaros and everything. So it does chop off a little bit of head space. You know what I'm saying? But nevertheless, it's still nice. Showing y'all the back, y'all see, really ain't nobody fin back there for real, man. You can put a little, I don't know, maybe one two year old, but that's about it, man. Well, my I would say my size, my size. Two people sitting there, you ain't fit about it, you know, too much back there. Maybe a normal, normal every size person, you fit somebody back there, but like I said, it is still nice, y'all. But yeah, man. So let's go into the trunk. Opening up the trunk. Y'all know this Camaro, they don't have a lot of space in them at all. So looking down up in there, man. It's, you know, it's a little space. You can go grocery shopping, but, you know, don't think you're gonna do nothing crazy in here. Y'all see the opening right here is, it's small, man. And just tell y'all the truth, it's small. Like I said, this Camaro is a smaller car, but nevertheless, like I said, you still can put a little something. You can go grocery shopping still, y'all. But coming under here, I'm gonna lift this up. Y'all see nothing down there. This one don't have a spare. So most likely run flats. So we're gonna close this down. Let's see what's under the hood. So coming up to the hood, man. Let y'all see what's under here. Uh, there we go. There you got, you got your V8 right there, man. Pushing out 455 horses. Yeah, see, I know the thing. Get on down, get on down. It's nice up there, man. Yeah, that's very nice, man. Y'all know the SS is just good for handling, you know what I'm saying? Other than that, like the Dodge Chargers and stuff like that, you know, more like pony cars for straight line, but you just about to do anything in this one, man. 455 horsepower, not too shabby. But we're gonna close this down. So that's it for another one, y'all. Y'all see, I know y'all didn't get a uh, driving perspective 
Mm -hmm. Well, I'm at a new dealership, and so they not let me drive them, but they let me review them. So still, you know, thanks for that. But as I can see, man, the SS is still, this is very nice, man. Uh, you know what I'm saying? I have, like I said, I got the Camaro, the V6, one LT, but you want to kick it up a notch to the SS, man. You can't go wrong with it, you know what I'm saying? So anyways, man, y'all tell me what y'all like about the car, man. Y'all tell me, you know what I'm saying? What y'all don't like about the car? Tell me what I'm doing good, you know what I'm saying? Tell me what I can do better on, you know? That's it for another, man. Make sure you like, share, comment, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. And when you do, hit that post notification bell so you be notified every time I post. And uh, yes, man, that's another one. LBJ CarPlay, out.